Cancer. Oh shit. What's poppin' Cancer? You see blue for the throat chakra. Happy uh Mercury Day. The song that's playing for you is Having Our Way. Soon as I link with these niggas, they feel as are written all over them. Okay, great. Let's put 30,000 on some of these greats. Some of these no wonder we get in this shape. No way to put action cells with both front of your face. Yeah, they talk to me different when they see my little oh, Lucian brain. Can't serve. Can't see my brain. But look at the plane. The fuck are you saying? The fuck are you saying? Big at the one that I don't know how to get around in my city for shame. Nope. You gotta go in with the game. I don't know why I turn on my eyes, I don't know how to turn on There we go. All right, Cancer, this is the first card out. Now, that's you. I don't know if you're fighting somebody, somebody fighting you. You might not be having your way right now, so you're in altercation. Somebody might not be having their way with you and you got and you having your, you having to find yourself in a defensive situation. You might be in an altercation because people want to abuse you, but you're not letting them abuse you no more. So now they're being combative towards you. You feel me? Once you take... Once an abuser can't abuse, they abused anymore. They get upset and now they want to fight you. You feel me? Now you're getting some sort of resistance because you're tired of being lied to. You're tired of being played. You're tired of somebody having their way with their emotions, your feelings, your passion, or your communication. They manipulate everything you say and use it against you in some way, shape, or form, and you about sick of it. So now you probably fighting somebody now or somebody trying to fight you. You're in some sort of conflict either with yourself as far as how you think, how you move, how you act, how you talk, you got different personalities inside of your head uh, combating for the main seat. See, because you probably put a stop to something because this on the split, on the split. You probably put a stop to something and then whatever you put a stop to got you in conflict now because it's like, man, we ain't, I'm not going down without a fight type vibe. You feel me? I'm not going, no, nah, we ain't done yet. You feel me? This shit ain't done yet. Because uh, Libra season being a balance to your life. So you may be fighting this for these next 30 days. You may be fighting for these next 30 hours, 30 minutes, 30 seconds. You, or you're just fighting yourself right now, period. you in some sort of mental battle or battle outside of your physical reality. Outside in your physical reality because of emotions. Boy, this shit accurate. You shot your shot. You said something to somebody and that shit was accurate. They didn't like what you said, but you moving on to bigger and better things with the King of Pentacles out chill. So you might be man of this like you in conflict, but you still handling what the fuck you got to handle. You feel me? You still manifesting or it's like you fighting for your peace now, in a sense. You ain't gonna let nobody take your shit from you. Yo, whatever, whatever mentality you built. But nah, whatever you was fighting for or whatever you was working on, you fighting to maintain that stability. You fighting to maintain that peace or somebody outside of you is stable and you're in an altercation with them and you trying to rock their boat, but you realize you can't rock their boat. So if, if you a toxic cancer or if you a cancer that hang out below the belt. You fighting somebody for they for their stability. You fighting somebody for they uh, cause they got something that you want, or they got something that you want to be a part of, but you can't be a part of, and you you now you losing your shit. Now you done jumped off the rails, or you fighting for your you fighting for what's yours. You fighting to keep maintain what's yours, or you fighting any anybody. That got something to say about your piece, you gonna get that motherfucker a slice of your mind. You gonna get him a whole slice. You're not gonna give him a piece, not a quarter, not a half, no motherfucker. You gonna get a yeah, I got some things I gotta say to you, motherfucker. If you gonna you think you're gonna come up in this bitch and disturb my piece. You think you're gonna come up in this bitch and disturb my job. You think you're gonna come up in my position and tell me what to do. You feel me? Type shit. Look, you got you got words for any motherfucker that try to come and slide at you in any, any any way, shape, or form. Regarding what you built. So long as that plan is fuck up some commas, I'm telling you. You whatever you invested in, you fucking it up. 
I mean, you, you and you fighting for it. It's like whatever you, you whatever you win, you fighting for it. Y'all need to give me one more goddamn card though. If I was a punk, if I was a punk, yeah, yeah. If I was a punk, cancel. Oh, now y'all don't niggas don't got shit to say no more. <laughs> okay, boom. Justice in reverse. Okay, so now it's like. Somebody, the, the overall energy is like somebody is getting the shorter end of the stick here. Okay, I'm going to be honest. Like if justice was upright, I'm getting this is like, this is balance being restored to a situation. But this might be rocking someone's foundation because they feel like this isn't fair. This isn't right. So if this is you fighting somebody because they got something you want, you like, this ain't even fair. You feel like it ain't fair. Oh, why do they get this? Oh, how come, how come I thought, you know, I worked hard enough? No, motherfucker, you ain't work hard enough. Now you're trying to fight somebody else for something that ain't even yours. How you gonna fight? How you gonna take someone's gift? You feel me? This is a gift. You can't take no gift from somebody. You fucking goofy. Or... If this is somebody that you fighting for what you got to maintain what you already have, somebody feel like it ain't, it ain't even fair. Whoever's, whoever's on the receiving end of the hands, they feel like it ain't even fair. They feel like you fucking up some comments, you should share your comments. Why Why you only fucking up comments by yourself? They might want to use either you bring this conflict, is you bringing communication to a motherfucker to let you know, hey, yo, you ain't, you ain't getting a slice of this cake. Or somebody just like you, you and it, it, it could really go when you, you got to take, take, take your pick. All right. Can't tell you where you're at. Only you can tell you where you're at. But somebody is in a state of battle. Now you are fighting to maintain something. You are fighting. You might have been at your job. You know, last week you were slacking off. Then this week, the uh, the regional manager came through the store. Now you're working extra hard on your shift because you ain't trying to get cut. You know, this job is what keep you stable. And if you get cut, you feel like it ain't going to be fair. You know, they did an audit, goddammit. Now they're reviewing all the employees' work ethic. Now you on the radar. You feel me? You you feel like that ain't really fair justice because y'all ain't tell us you y'all was coming. If y'all told us... Y'all was coming last week, we would have worked a little, you know, I would have shaped up a little bit, but you feel me? You was in that season, that wave, that current of when you at work and you you really wasn't working, you feel me? Everybody go through that pattern, like you, you grind hard for like one to two months, one to two days, three to four hours, and then you go in the bathroom and relax. And then you go and you, you start slacking off for, for a week. You give yourself a week break to charge your batteries, you feel me? So that's for somebody out this motherfucker. But that's what you got, cancel on the fuck charge. Hey.